So here we have the Moodle course for the spring 2021 semester for Physics 132. And I'm going to give you a brief tour of some of the key features. So of course, the syllabus with which you are already familiar. And then just below that, there is a checklist of what you should be doing this week. So this will get updated each and every week. Uh, you can open it here and check off what you need to do. You can also add your own items if you think that that's helpful. Uh, and you've got direct links to some of the items if it is relevant. Another way to access the checklist is over here on the right of the screen. You can see the little bar and you can click that and that'll take you to the checklist. Below the checklist, we have the course calendar. This is based upon some feedback from students in the fall semester. They thought a Google Calendar would be helpful. Uh, and on this calendar, the, the default is week view, but you can change it to month or whatever. And you can see, you know, class times here in blue. In red, you've got various uh, help sessions. You've got my help session here. You've got one by Sara. And we will uh, add some more as we get more TAs and, and more people on board. You can add this calendar to your own Google account or to your personal devices and get alerts and whatnot if you like, just by clicking this little uh, plus Google calendar here. That'll add it to your account, making it uh, you know, easier to keep track of assignments. Assignments speaking of, show up in yellow on the day that they are due. So here you can see the first homework. Below that, you've got the Zoom link for all the classes and the Echo 360 recordings of those classes, which is where they'll appear uh, after the edits. Then you've got the, a link to the textbook. So if you click this, it'll open up the textbook in a new window for you. So this is where you can do the reading and get the information you need for the homework. And then you've got a folder of what we're going to learn in this class, math you should know, other useful stuff. Um, so you can see the exactly what we're going to cover in this class. Here, um, some 3D printed models that might be useful some algebra practice problems with solutions if you would need to refresh, and then my Physics 131 textbook. And you can, in fact, download the entire thing all at once if you like. Okay, then you've got the help forum where you've got announcements, all that sort of thing. So you can come in here and you see the forum <clears throat> and you can uh, reply to uh, whatever you see. All right. So, and it's default anonymous, but you can reveal yourself if you like. Um, and then also here at the top, you'll have things like indicating your team preference or various other bonus activities. This is where they'll always appear is here at the top. And all this top part will appear in every single uh, section. So then you've got the lab. Uh, this will get flushed out in the next few days. So let's jump on to our first unit. So you can click the unit here. You can also click it over on the side. It'll take the same thing. You'll notice that the key stuff for the course, the syllabus, the checklist, the calendar, Zoom, Echo, the textbook, you know, all that sort of stuff is still there. And then you hit sort of the meat of the unit. You've got the equation sheet, uh, the homework, um, and make your life easy when you're doing the homework. Read the book, or you can connect to each problem through the relevant page. Uh, this will be described in a little bit more detail. You've got some additional practice problems, because I know that some people just like to have additional practice. This is where I'll post the slides for the unit, and the Moodle quizzes will appear here. Uh, you can navigate uh, backwards and forwards here or on the side. So we advance forward to the exam. Once again, the basics of the course are always at the top. And then so here you've got the information for the first exam. You've got the exam one equation sheet. 
a video on help you to prepare, and then the practice exam already all here. You'll notice that each begins with a date uh, for units. This is the day and time the homework is due. And then for exams, this is the description of the exam period. Okay. So that's sort of a brief tour of the Moodle course as it is for this class. Hopefully you have found this video helpful. And this concludes this video.